time to spotlight another town in the Carolinas. Of course, it's our hometown spotlight. It's sponsored by Dave Edwards Toyota. This week, we're taking you to a city known as the peach capital of South Carolina, where coincidentally, they're having a big peach festival. That's right. Can you guess where this is? We've got a map. <laughs> Da -da -da. Gaffney, Christine Scarpelli. All right, maps later. And the photographer Ryan, they are live this morning to tell us more about it. Hey, Christine. I love it. Hey, you guys. Good morning. They are so excited about this, by the way. We've got Leanne Snugs here. She is, I call her boss lady of Gaffney. She, no yes, she has organized so many great things for us. We've really spent a lot of time here this week getting some video, talking to the people, which is always the most fun part about these hometown spotlights. Here in Gaffney, there's so much going on. Big Peach Festival happening until the 22nd. We've got more on that in just a second, but really, downtown Gaffney is happening. You guys have a Main Street Challenge. New business opened up. Leanne, what does everybody Everybody need to know. Uh, wow, they need to know. There's still opportunity. <laughs> we are um, just busting at the seams. We just opened our first business. Y'all joined us on Wednesday. All so day. Sweet Life Creamery. We've is got on. some video of that. Take a look right now. That was and good. We've got um, an escape room opening in September. Another restaurant from the Main Street Challenge is opening in August. Okay. Boston Annie's. Then we have another restaurant that should be opening by October the first. There's also opportunities. We still have some vacant buildings. We have some buildings for sale. We've got great antique stores, Hartzog's Jewelry and Gift Shop. Lots of lots of good reasons to get into Gaffney. Those restaurants, one of them a sub shop, right? And yes, Boston Annie's. She'll be opening in mid-August, so maybe before the college students get back to Limestone. Oh, Ooh, yeah. I like that. Now we have a new place to go to lunch when we come right. to stories here. Absolutely. Seafood one, we we think, as well. There's right, another restaurant. Right, hopefully opening in September. Um, yes, our grant requires that we we open by October 1st, so good. we're keeping our fingers crossed that we have that one coming just right around the corner. Very good. Things you can come check out. Peach Festival happening this weekend. It happened last weekend, too. A parade coming up. Live music. Lots of food right here downtown Gaffney. Leanne, I love it. Thank you so much. We've got so much more to come this morning. Uh, guys, enjoy those donuts, too. We visited Sunny's Donuts, an epic I'm business. waiting for them to open. You got me out too early. Okay. <laughs> then Leanne's going to go get some more, but we have some for you guys. Make sure producers, directors, everybody Everybody at 7 News, you got to go get some of those. Photographer we have Ryan spread put the there word. They, the we spread the word. That was so amazing Good. that they did that for you us. You better. Yeah. Yeah. Good, because last time I know you kept them all for yourself. So now oh, we got to spread what? the love. Christine. I don't, I, don't, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> we have to run, as a matter of fact. We'll it's it's producer in our ear. It's 4.54. Thanks, Christine. Daybreak will be right back. We're going to get you back later. <laughs>